Welcome to this edition of Spotlight. We are at Line Creek Elementary with Principal Robin Davis. And Robin, trauma-informed care has become an important part of all of our schools in Park Hill. Can you talk about some positive changes you've made at Line Creek? Well, as you mentioned, trauma-informed care is an important part at all of our schools here in Park Hill. And we've rebranded some of our spaces here at Lion Creek to be more proactive in giving students a break, and it's really working well. Well, let's see some positive changes and places where kids are uh, working on their social, emotional, and behavior skills. And let's spotlight Lion Creek Elementary. Trauma-informed care is kind of just taking a student's background and just as everything that a student has had and ha has going on in their life and using that and applying it in your classroom and in your teaching. Um, and one thing that's been a big change for us this year here at Line Creek is um, that trauma-informed care really is for, for everybody. Um, and we've done that by kind of changing our safe spot in our classroom. In the past, we used the safe spot maybe for the students who were struggling that day or who might be in trouble. Um, and this year, we're using a calming corner that is more for just everybody. The difference is the teacher is not telling them when to go to this calming corner or to take a break. Um, students are noticing when they're feeling certain emotions, whether they're good emotions or negative emotions. Um, and they're learning to go in that area and um, use different tools that are back there or to just take a break from what they're doing. Calming corner is kind of like if you're mad or like having strong emotions, you just go there and kind of cool yourself down. I like how it calms me down and I can share out my feelings so I don't have anything locked up inside of me. I was having a lot of students come to me with problems and now that we've started to use the calming corner that's kind of that we've put that on the students and so they've really started to use that themselves rather than coming to me and saying I need help with X, Y, and Z. They're able to take a five minute break, kind of calm down and collect themselves and then solve the problem without teacher help. Instead of like going to the teacher because during their teaching, maybe they're teaching or doing something really important that helps me just go to Comic Corner, figure it out by myself. A lot of times frustration comes out of the academics when they're not getting it, when they see their peers are moving on faster than them. Um, so it allows them to pause from what they're working on, go refocus, um, and it's kind of neat too because other students will notice that. And so now I am no longer the only person asking, hey, are you okay? Other kids are coming up and asking, hey, I noticed you're in the calming corner, how can I help? Um, and then that allows them later to focus on their academic work. Um, and they understand, hey, there's people in here that can help me. I don't need to feel frustrated or upset over little things. It teaches me how I can give my feelings out to people I can trust and it makes me feel positive about myself. Mm -hmm. 